know. I, I can I can change my PAL setting. I, should should I be changing this to something other than what it is? I mean, so far the game says 25 FPS and the video is 50 FPS. Should I be? Mm, um, maybe I'll set it to 60. The, the more the merrier, right? The game's definitely detection. Why not? Okay, we're just gonna go for that and pray that I didn't break the game by accident. All right. Well, looks good so far. Oh, D3. Hate you guys, you made work time fun. And that generally broke me. Oh, I got all but like one achievement out of like 275 in that game. Oh, that's spooky. Oh, good. Well, now I'm going to get nightmares. It's 9.30, I've got work tomorrow, and I'm not going to be able to sleep because of that horrible loading screen. Well, this seems nice. It also seems very English. Winked et un. How's it going, Jackson, mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're here with a game called Zombie Virus. Now, this is one of those unknown games that, I mean, it says it was released in Europe. I highly doubt this was released in England in time, like, soon. I'm going to press start and just kind of maybe look at the options or something. But, like, so, um, you know back when I was playing the Transformers game, the Transformers hyphen the game, I said that I was going to do some retro achievements games. Well, this is another recent entry as of 28th of March 2024, and I've never heard of this. I've, uh, this is completely new to me. It even though like, I had a bit of a weird name when I was on the um, uh, Retro Achievements website. But looking at it now, it doesn't look that bad. Maybe a bit weird, maybe a bit... 2006? This looks terrible for 2006. Alright, but like, I literally just wanted to give this a little go. Gonna do four episodes, hopefully I have a good time. I mean, I guess it's some kind of princess story, like a princess is waiting for a prince to come, and then, uh, and then this guy comes along instead, and then it's just a horrible date. I don't know, who knows what happens to this? Something happens, in it? Uh, we'll go normal, so I actually have somewhat of a challenge. But I literally do not know what to, I don't know what to expect from this game. It could be absolutely amazing, absolutely terrible. Oh, a multiple city made under the Utopia development, of course there's Utopia in it. Development project to provide a comfortable functional place to live in. Oh, good. Sunlight City! It's about as cliche as whatever they did in Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Because anyone's allowed to live there, some areas did fall into poverty. Right. But as a new type of city, it showed tremendous growth. Really? Are you sure? How is that? Okay. Of the five areas that are divided into, the most important zone was Central Town. If you say so. One young medical student worked here at Sunlight Hospital. Alright, I guess if it's like a town or something. And he was one day doing research in the archives in the basement of the University Hospital. Alright, sounds like just another day in the office, seems nice. With his friend Susie, but the Z looks like a 2, so it's like su tui. Alright, cool. As the two continued their research in silence, something bizarre suddenly happened. Did his fucking nipples disappear? With a booming roar, an earthquake struck the city. Well, must be all this growth or something. Must have ruined the, the, the environment. Fortunately, the earthquake soon stopped. But something was wrong. Uh, I don't know. Did someone like, realise that their fucking hand had dropped off or something? Everything was just a bit too quiet. The hall outside, bustling just a minute ago, was now eerily silent. Well, maybe some people died because of the earthquake. Did you think of that? Ah, uh, this is some storytelling. The two looked at each other uncertainly. They opened the heavy archives door. Climbed the stairs to the ground floor. And locked, looked, at, looked outside a window to see. Okay, okay, no. Dark clouds choking up the sky. A continuing silence. Doesn't sound very silent right now. Yep, yeah, they're very silent. Not a single person. The whole city had died. Except had died looks like one word to me there. Alright. Uh, where had everybody gone? I don't fucking know. Suddenly far off in the horizon, Suzy saw a presence emerge and gulped. What is this fan fiction nonsense? Uh, maybe I can have a cutscene or something. Oh, never mind. The presence looks human, but was definitely not human. Def I'm pretty certain of that, she said. Fucking, the two hurried to the basement garage in an attempt to hide. Even though the fucker was like light years away. Alright, maybe they uh, could smell him. It was difficult not to panic in this situation, except the fucker's still ages away. Alright, and then the game began, I guess. 
Uh, I guess we're going to go for that. I mean, uh, the premise seems fair enough. We'll fucking teleport the town into a... Oh, okay. Well, this is nicely animated for... Well, I mean, like, compared to what we had... Oh, my God. Hey, calm down! Okay. Calm down! What's that? Oh, calm down! Yeah, I'm shaking in my shoes right now. Yep. Yeah. What do you expect? What is that movement? Who who the fuck designed this? You saw those things walking around town. Actually, I just saw one thing. I don't know what you're on about, you liar. Are you seeing, are you seeing something that we're not seeing? Okay. Uh, oh, what the f Okay, well, now there's multiple things. All right, these guys seem nice. Seems like a regular House of the Dead movie. Uh, I know what you're feeling. Or what are you feeling? I know what are you feeling. What are you feeling, though? But you're a... Doctor, aren't you? Does that have anything to do with anything? What are those movements? Oh, a radio. We're going to play Silent Hill 2? Sunlight. Tie. Enormous damage. 90%. Citizens die. You could speak that bit clearly enough, but not city. Those alive. Waiting for death. Well, we're not. We want to survive, don't we? This situation. Yeah, yeah, it's certainly a situation. Uh, cool. You're right. Some of us are still alive. Yeah, again, award-winning dialogue. The first thing we've got to do is find them. Yeah, we'll do that and survive the onslaught. Then we've got to take them out of the city. Uh, what, what if it's like the whole universe? The politicians who live here should have... Oh, we're getting political now, are we? The keys to the gates of this city. What? What do you mean the keys to the gates of this city? You saying we were locked in? I knew you'd say that. I, I didn't know he was going to say that. That was out of nowhere. Tell me that fucking politician locks us up. That Wi-Fi radio looks useful. If you say so, let's take it with us just in case. Maybe I can get some Duran Duran on it. Save a prayer to the morning after. This hospital's our last hope. We'll need to... Uh, uh, be able to stay in touch with the survivors, even though we can't really contact them, but whatever. There's an ambulance. Let's take that. Is that going to be like a driving mechanic in this game? Is it going to be a good driving mechanic? All right, that was uh, some kind of... St oh, my God. Whoa, look at me run. It's like a... No, I can't turn the screen, though. Oh, i got to admit, this is very unusual for D3. Wait, where's that radio? I don't know where it is. Is it over here? Do I need to, like, get it from the girl or something? Or have I already got it? Alright, so what do some of these buttons do? Oh, okay, well, uh, options is the start menu. Well, what about select? Select does not... Okay, so I can either move or press pause. I suppose it's early stages thus far. Oh, uh, oh I can save with you. Well, I, I did have to deal with that very slow text. I don't think I want to deal with that again. Alright, save the game. Good for me. Man, I gotta say, I kind of like this. Like, it's one of those, like, weird horror games, but it's got, like, stuff going on. It looks quite pretty for the time. Uh, wait a minute. They, they weren't here before, were they? I'll tell you everything I know. Oh my god, what the hell is all this? Shaking off, technique... Survivor? Survivors are scattered all through the city. Okay. Uh, rescued, max morale, research. The, uh, so I'm guessing this is some kind of like driving game. But does that make sense? I only say that because if this is a driving game, how come we've got such a nice like high definition little uh, thing going on here? Alright, fine, cool, great. Fun times had by all. Uh, I tell you what, I am curious. I've got, I've got to check this. What are the achievements? I, I just want to see what we got. So we got defeat the mutant. Sorry, like I can't be reading that right. <laughs> I genuinely didn't know that. What the fuck? Defeat the mutant caterpillar. 
That, that, that's normal, is it? Defeat the mutant butterfly. Defeat the well, veterans. Well, veteran zombies I've seen before. Origin of the zombie virus. Doesn't look like that much of a long... There's only 20 achievements. I'm going to say, I'm definitely intrigued by this game. I, I, I just wanted to see that. I've got to make sure I remember that. I need to change the screen for you guys, but... uh, Okay, cool. How the... Oh, wait a minute. Are these numbers meant to be, like, level numbers? So that's why this bit's open here, because I can get in and do my thing. Uh, yeah, I guess I... Well, you know what? I wouldn't have figured that out. But I guess now I can drive in the game could have solved it. Yeah, I'll give him that nightmare face again. Very beautiful to look at. This is exquisite. Exquisite right here. Okay. So what's actually the gameplay? What do I do? Am I just running over zombies? Or am I... Am I shooting anything? Or... Man, this is really... Now it kind of looks like Silent Hill to me. Except much, much, much less developed. There still doesn't seem to be anybody. Except for those zombies, which are just hiding or something. Yeah, you should go on your... Wait! Something moved over there! Oh, fuck! What could it be? Uh, hello? Hello? Excuse me! I'm looking for the nearest dominoes. Oh, okay. I mean, damn! It's coming this way! Don't know why he's doing that. Seems a bit stupid now you think about it. Can I run him over? Is that a distinct... Oh, my God. Uh, okay. This shows the durability of the vehicle, and the game ends when it runs out. Going below a certain point will reduce vehicle performance. We return to the hospital will probably restore it. All right, fine. The survivor gauge. This this well, <laughs> this gagger, different for each type of survivor, starts filling up when the survivor gets on. The gagger level can be reduced by picking up vaccines. Morale. Okay. Radar map. Doesn't really tell me where I need to go or what the fuck I'm doing. All right, seems like a simple kind of drivey thing. Definitely feels like something made in Asia, probably Japan. I mean, look, look at that manga running animation around the screen. Yes! Wow, that was satisfying. But I don't, I don't understand what I'm doing. Like, uh, yeah. So fuck you. <laughs> what was that sound? <laughs> yeah, I murdered something. What? What am I doing right now? What is this? All right. Uh, do I go here? What's this bit? Uh, am I meant to, to murder or not to murder? What are you doing? Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, okay. So I'm literally just collecting survivors or some shit. All right. Now I got the arrow taking me back. Well, that doesn't seem so bad. Whoa! Uh, all right. Do you want to come in, friend? All right, now I've got two humans. Is this uh, is this going anywhere? Where the fuck do I take you guys? All right, in this bit, was that actually the whole level? Was that it? I didn't even get to see any mutant caterpillars. That's disappointing. Okay, maybe we'll end up with like a huge like fucking room of people, and then everyone's gonna oh brilliant! I got a mechanic and a soldier. The above were rescued, and do, do they actually end up in the? Oh, they do. Well, I, I hope you appreciate what I've done for you, piece of shit. There are still many survivors left in the city. We'll protect the hospital, so please rescue them. Alright, cool. And the mechanic, what, you repair my vehicle or some shit? Uh, hello. Hello. Look at me! Oh, okay. You, uh, we've got a new mechanic, so we can now develop the the bare bone tires. Got, uh, okay, I can develop stuff. Okay, and then that... So rescuing people will get you... Huh. That's kind of cool. I don't know what I want, though. Maybe it may just do the tires. Yeah, go on. 14 more zombies until completion. Oh, it's like a research tree. And then you get new vehicles. Okay. And these guys are just trainers. I mean, that's definitely interesting. But again, like... What the fuck am I doing with myself? What, what's my objective here? What's my motivation? Alright, well, I know I'm kind of reaching my time limit here, but I kind of want to try and go for one more round and see who else I can rescue. See if maybe, like, I don't know, like, playing a bit longer, killing some zombies, doing my thing, we'll actually get the game to develop in a... Uh, okay, find a politician. Oh, okay, and we need that for the keys, right? 
Survivors left in central... 43?! No politicians appearing on the stage. Numbers needed to be saved for the next politician to appear. Uh, okay, so this is going to be a looping... Hmm. Wait, but what about the map? Can I see the map? Oh, I can see a map. Is it a big map? Oh, that's tiny. What do all the X's mean? Alright, well, I can go to different bits. I, I guess we can have a little look around. Not really sure about that morale, though. Alright, I guess I can start slaughtering some people. Yes! Ow, ow, ow! How do I shake you off? Whoa! Okay, I don't know what happened there, but that wasn't good for me. I, I just pressed buttons and hope for the best. Die! Pick up this person. Oh, I hope you can be useful. I hope you're not... No, I don't want to reproduce with you. I just want to, you know, survive. That seems more important right now. Alright, who else can I find? Uh, can I go west area? No, nope, it's fucking locked. Oh, and that's why I need the uh, politician, right? Because he'll unlock the gates for me. That seems relatively useless. Alright, and my morale is seriously going down. So what happens when I run out of morale? Am I going to die? Am I going to lose all my progress? All that hard work? Alright, I don't particularly want to go back to the hospital yet. No, honestly, I want to try and get... I want to fill up that other... Oh, God. She got health. What? What? What happened? Why, why didn't you have an orgasm in my car? You didn't need to do that. That was inappropriate. Why, should, why did I save you? Were you uh... Oh, she's getting angsty because I'm murdering so many people. Uh, okay, so she's a pussy. Great. Alright, cool. We'll bother. I hope she doesn't mind the fact I just murdered her, like, all those people. I hope I don't like There's, there's going to be no consequences from that. Alright, I rescued a female civilian. I'm sure she'll be a wonderful addition to our fucking bullshit. Is she even fucking here? Like, is, is she going to, like, talk to me if I go up to her? No. I wasted my motherfucking time. Well, that's what I get. That's what I get for fucking trying. Okay, but I am going to call this an end to the Let's Play right now. i got to say, I kind of like this game. Um, especially for a D3 game, because I never really think highly of them. But, hey, on the other hand, like, it's kind of fun. I like a good zombie game. And this isn't, like, just a typical, like... Shoot them up kind of thing. You get to run everything over. It's fun. You got a little walk around thing. It's got variety. I like it. So I'm going to do three more episodes of this. I, I don't know what like opening like a gate and stuff will do for me. If it will actually make the game more interesting. Maybe open a boss. Maybe open some missions. I don't know. But I guess we'll see what happens in the next episode. But if you want to play the game, you can give this uh, zombie virus thing a go. There'll be a link to the game in the description down below. And without further ado, do a subscribe to this time. See ya.